Hello crafty friends, it's Alicia of the Call Me Crafty Al YouTube channel and it is time for the monthly sheet load showcase. I hope that you'll stick around and see what each of my collaborators created this month. Thank you so much for stopping by today. If this is your first time to my channel, I hope that by the end of this video, you'll be inspired to click on that subscribe button below and ring that bell for notifications. If you're already a subscriber and regular viewer, welcome back. I'm so glad that you're here again. Each month, I like to stop by and share a look with you at what my collaborators created using the latest sheet load of cards. For today, that is going to be the July 2022 sheet load. And this month's sketch, as long as you follow the supply list and cutting guides, is going to yield you 12 cards. This is a great one to get started on your Christmas or holiday card stash make sets for friends or family, or just build up your own card stash to send out later. In front of me are the cards that I created. I will have the debut video, which is where I show you a look at these close up and tell you how to download the free printable, linked in that description box below. And then I also have the monthly process video where I show you how I made them. That is also down there in the description box. Now today I'll be sharing my collaborator cards, but if you're interested in sharing a look at yours, don't forget that here on YouTube and over on Instagram or TikTok to use the hashtags at the top of the printable. And you can also send in a card for the end of the month showcase. I do have a video with all of those details in that description box below. After you see all of the amazing cards today, I know that you're gonna wanna go get some more information on them and maybe see some close-ups. So I do have everybody linked down below. Also, to see all of the videos here on YouTube, you can click on the hashtag in the title. And I also have a link to the Instagram hashtag search in the description box. I know that everybody would love for you to stop by, see what they created and leave them some love. Why don't we go ahead and take a look at their cards? First up and new to the team is Ashley of Mint Twist Cards. For her set this month, she used a variety of sentiments and patterns. And make sure to check out her video to find out how she made 96 cards using the July 2022 sketch with a single pad of paper. Welcome to the team, Ashley. Also new to the team this month is Karen of Karen's Crafting Company. For her first set with us, she used some beautiful papers with a hint of gold, and I like how she went ahead and added some inking to her sentiment shapes. Welcome to the team, Karen! Teresa of Fresh and Renewed with Teresa created a set of sea themed cards for the month. I am loving those cute seahorses and the fun sentiment to go with them. Beth of Bourbon Creek Crafts went with a Christmas in July theme this month, which I think you'll notice some others today did as well. I'm loving those fun pattern papers, the variety of sentiments, and the little touches with those added stickers. Next up is Amalia from Cool Cakes and Crafts with Amalia, and I am loving the metallic she added to her set this month and that wonderful sentiment. Amalia likes to use up an entire paper pad with sheet loads until it is all gone and this month did complete her last paper pad. So make sure to watch her video and she gives you some new options of what she's going to move on to next. I know that she would love your input. I am loving this set from Karen Aiken. She has used that large cactus embellishment on her cards to match the feel of her papers. And the fun shape of her sentiment was also a nice addition. 
Toby of the Bitty Penny channel has thought outside of the box this month to create these elegant 5x7 winter or Christmas cards. I am loving the white on white with that added touch of gold. I am loving this patriotic set from Yvette of Yvette Olea Creates. I love those fun 4th of July papers and how she has used some of the cut aparts or stickers from the pad for her focal points. Danny of Danny's Dreams channel created a set of birthday cards this month. I am loving the mostly black and white papers with that added touch of, I don't know if it's dark pink or red, just beautiful. I usually struggle with typical masculine cards and Chelsea of the Creative Chelsea channel has knocked it out of the park this month. I am loving the fun papers and focal points on these and how she has switched up the layout just a little bit including rotating the sketch some. First up on the Instagram team is Noemi who is at AZ Crafty. She has also went with a Christmas in July theme for her cards. I am absolutely loving those cute little sweaters and mittens and socks that she has embellished her sentiment with. And I think I might even spy some vellum there. At Stamp with Sandy, aka Sandy, has created a set of Christmas cards this month. I am loving the variety of pattern papers in her set and how she has decorated each of her sentiment ovals with some stamping as well. Jessica, who is at Jessie Kate Creates, made this set of gorgeous holiday cards. I am loving the gold metallic mat behind her triangles, as well as that gold embossing on the sentiment. Now, not only is she on Instagram, but she also has a channel here on YouTube, and this month she did share a look at her July 2022 cards, and I will tell you the sparkle on video is so pretty. I hope you will check her video out. I will have it linked in the description box below. Also, while you're there, I found out that about two days before Danny and I were at Scrap Mania in Iowa, that Jessica was there as well. Um, she has shared a video on her channel where she shows you the goodies that she got, and she found like a, a crafty thrift store, almost like a crafty Goodwill, where you decide what you want to pay for the items you want. And let me tell you, what she got for $10 was amazing. So I hope you'll check that video out. It will be linked in that description box below as well. Lisa, who is at Scrapbook Girl on Instagram, created a cute set of birthday cards this month. I love the variety of focal points, especially that little unicorn over there on the right. At Fuzzy Slippers Designs, aka Mariah, created a set of Celebrate cards this month. I'm loving those pattern papers, especially the little campers with that wood grain. And if you look closely, you'll see that the mats behind her triangles are different pattern papers. Stacy, who is at Craftaholic Mama, created this set of 12 adorable cards using Doodlebug's My Happy Place collection. I love the fun papers and those cute little focal points that she added. And last but certainly not least is Barbara who is at One Busy Bee on Instagram. She went with a Christmas theme as well. I am loving the mint green and pink combo on her pattern papers and how she has decorated each of her sentiments with that cute little bow. Wasn't that such an inspiring showcase? I always love to visit their videos and posts on the second, but seeing them here all together is such a special treat to see how everybody makes it their own and how the same sketch can look completely different. If you agree and enjoyed the video, a thumbs up is always appreciated. Don't forget you can visit their links in that description box below. And until my next video, I hope you're all having a crafty day.
Bye bye. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch all the way to the end of the video. Now I hope that you'll consider clicking on one of the playlists or videos I have linked above.